Hello, I'm Dave Caldwell with your SV News Break for Wednesday, January 7th. A man accused in an allegedly violent Castaic home invasion pled not guilty at his preliminary arraignment on Tuesday. 20 year old Sal Madrano of Elkhart, Indiana, was accused of knocking on the door and attempting to break in to former Castaic Town Councilman Jeff Preach's home on Sunday. Preach and his cousin managed to hold Madrano at gunpoint until deputies arrived at the scene. Madrano has been charged with two counts of attempted first degree residential robbery and first degree burglary and three counts of resisting arrest. He is due back in court on January 14th when a judge will decide if there is enough evidence to go to trial. State Senator Fran Pavley will have membership to several Senate committees for the current legislative session in Sacramento. In addition to chairing the Senate Natural Resources and Water Committee, Pavley will sit on a number of other committees in the 2015 through 2016 legislative session. Designated committee chairs and members will be formally adopted by the Senate Rules Committee when it convenes on Wednesday. There's a new sub sandwich place in town and it offers more than just a delicious lunch treat. Haley Cook found out more. Firehouse Sub celebrated its grand opening on Wednesday in Valencia. The Firehouse inspired restaurant not only offers a unique experience, but a unique kind of sandwich. We steam the meat and cheese, so it's not just heated up in a microwave or whatnot. So the steaming of the meat comes through with the cheese, and so it gives that unique, you know, warm, hot feeling with the toasting of the bread, so it melds all together. So that's really what makes us unique. The national chain isn't your typical sub sandwich shop. The restaurant boasts different kinds of meats in a very different order than what you would see at a traditional shop. Our most popular sandwich is the hook and ladder. It comes with turkey and Virginia honey ham. Um, it's delicious. We do fully involved here and what that is, it's the basics. It's mayonnaise, lettuce, tomato, onion, and a thin line of deli mustard with a dill pickle on the side. What makes us also kind of unique is that we offer a hot sauce bar and we have over 35 different kinds of hot sauce ranging from one to ten. Um, we have some tens. We keep those locked up. So you have to ask for the tens. Every location is different and aims to reflect the community and its surrounding landmarks. It's all fire related. So we have the axes, we have vintage pickaxes and pipe poles. Firehouse Subs has a different mural that's representative of their community. We have the New Hall sign there and of course Magic Mountain. That's what you think of when you say Valencia or Santa Clarita. And then of course we have our fire truck with 126 because that's our local one. Unique sandwiches aren't the only thing that sets this restaurant apart. The Florida-based chain also prides itself in giving back to first responders. In 2005, the brothers actually were involved in Hurricane Katrina with feeding the first responders and the survivors. So basically, they that, that kind of changed the whole concept of not only a submarine sandwich place that is unique in itself in the way we do our sandwiches, but then it was, I want to give back to the community. So what they did is across the nation, we all ask everybody to round up with every single order that we do. With that, we pool our money for first responders. The new to SoCal restaurant is located at the cross section of Valencia Boulevard and Magic Mountain Parkway. Business hours are Monday through Sunday from 10 a.m. to 9.30 p.m. For more information on how you can give back to local firefighters, you can log on to firehousesubs.com. I'm Haley Cook for SCV TV. In sports, College of the Canyon sophomore wide receiver Tim White has been named to the 2014 All-California Community College football team. White hauled in 55 passes for 667 yards and six touchdowns. He was also the Cougars' primary kick returner, bringing back 29 kicks for 812 yards, including a 100-yard return for a touchdown. A graduate of Hart High School and the U.S. Junior National Champion in the triple jump, White finished his sophomore season with 1,554 all-purpose yards for the Cougars. He was COC's lone representative. Now turning to weather, Santa Clarita saw partly cloudy skies on Wednesday with temperatures reaching the upper 70s. Tonight's low will see it drop to the mid-50s. The rest of the week is going to stay in the 70s until we hit the weekend. Saturday's forecast looks like a 50% chance of rain showers in the morning and intermittent showers in the late afternoon. Clouds may linger overnight, but Sunday will have only partial cloud coverage and highs in the upper 60s. That's all for your SCV News Break. For more local news, you can log on to hometownstation.com or scvnews.com. Thanks for watching. I'm Dave Caldwell.